caterpillars. I remember going around in the springtime and catching caterpillars. Now, some people might think it's weird or gross, and for the record, now that I've grown up, I kind of think it's gross too, but I remember it so vividly because it's just one of those things. You know? We all have them. Might be a toy, or a comic book, or a place. Places can be like snapshots of your youth. Memories manifested in a physical location, representing this huge part of your childhood. I remember Bonnie Springs, and now it's been 10 years since my last visit. So with my family, we decided to go back. Bonnie Springs started as a rest stop in the 1800s, an oasis in the desert. But since the 1950s, it's become a tourist attraction. The iconic train, a mainstay of the park, is something I hold very close. This is a picture of me at six years old, dressed as a conductor on the train. I had three heroes when I was six. Santa, Barney, and Richard, the guy who drove this train. I'm serious, I love this place. One of the attractions is the zoo, full of tons of animals from kangaroo to deer just wandering around. I remember being a little kid here, feeding deer taller than me how I have to bend down just to get a shot of them. Watching turtles run from me back into the water. This is a picture of me, four years old, walking like a badass. The zoo is combined with an old western town which they call Old Nevada. Because it is Old Nevada, it's the mental image of my upbringing. They have a daily hanging here, much like the actual state of Nevada, I guess. It's entertaining. Somebody that's always got the last word. So I guess it's got to be a woman. <laughs> yeah, entertaining. My dad was chosen from the crowd to participate as the judge. He even got wished happy birthday by everyone, almost as if fate was welcoming us back here. Old Nevada is a fun place to get lost in. It's vaguely menacing, but has a charm you can't quite place. It reminds me of home, even though it's not. It's Nevada, it's the desert, it's the environment I'm from. And although it's different, seemingly smaller now more than ever, and even though someone new drives the train, there's still Bunny Springs, there's still comic books, there's still caterpillars.